Okay, um, hello, good evening, everybody. Hi, teacher. Hello, how are you? I'm fine. Hi, teacher. Thanks, and you? Very nice, thank you. Very nice. Just um, listening to the to the rain because it's raining over here. Um, everything is good. Okay, so let's see how many students I have. Seven students. Okay, so we're going to start. We have a big schedule for today. Um, yesterday we were talking about what were we talking about yesterday? Do you remember? People future. Oh, yes. People future. We're going to. Yes, we're going to. Very good, very good. Nice. Uh, did we finish? We had two uh, two presentations with that topic, remember? Okay, so let's begin for today. <laughs> uh, let's begin. Let's see what we're going to do. Let me just place that presentation for today. Today we're going to talk about this, and I'm going to share it with you. Share. So we have ten now. Very good, very good. So everybody's joining. Uh, I was talking to. Let's see who was it. Yesenia. Yesenia was having problems logging in. Uh, I don't know what happened, but. Uh, somebody's helping her to, to get in, okay? So let's begin here. Let's see. I'm going to come the chair. It's here. here we go. Good. Everybody seeing this? Can everybody? Yeah. Yes. Okay, everybody sees this, um, this presentation, right? Good. So today we're going to talk about reduction of going to. Yesterday we were talking about uh, what is the simple future. The simple future is going to, which means in Spanish, uh, vas a hacer o voy a hacer. Okay, that, that is simple future, okay? Moving on. Okay. So today is Thursday, June 4th, 2020. So as I know, uh, this is the last day of, 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 of the classes. So tomorrow you don't have classes, Saturday no classes, and Sunday no classes. So we'll come back until Monday, correct? Right. Good. Okay, very good. So let's okay. see. Let me just turn on captions so you can read also what I'm saying. Winter. Very good. Okay, so we have here just get so fast here. Very good. Okay, let's begin. The rules and the achievement indicator is identify this class and talk about reduction of going to. Okay, so we're going to see what is a reduction, okay? Let's begin. As you can see, every day, as I prepare a class, I like to have the introduction so you can uh, greet and say hello to your classmates, okay? So let's see who's going to do it first. Okay, Angel Saravia and Carlos. Angel, you start, please. Uh, hi, Mario. Uh, what is uh, new today? Did you log in on time or where? you late this e evening. Hi, Laura. It is nice to see you this Thursday evening. There is nothing new with me. What I will do? No, uh, nothing new with uh, me either. either. Do you know? Either, either. Either. Yes. Uh, do, you, do you know? Uh, what we are going to learn today? Yes, I I know we are going to learn to success, successful successfully 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 
Identif no, identify. Identify. identify, 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 discuss, discuss and talk about, discuss and talk about. Yes. Re reductions of going to. Very good, very good. Okay, let's see who's next. Uh, Daniel and Gamaliel. Daniel, you start, please. Okay. Topic introduction. Hello, Mario. What's new today? Did you log in on time? Or where do you late this evening? Evening. Evening. E evening. 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 No. Evening. Evening. Yes, very good. Go. Okay. Thank you. Hi, Laura. It is nice to see you this Thursday evening. There is nothing new with me. What about you? No, nothing new with new with me. Aiden, do you know what either, we either. are going to either? Either, yes. Either do you know what we are going to learn today? Yes, I know. We are going to learn to successfully identify these groups and talk about reduction of going to. Very good. This is identify. Identify. Okay. Thank you very much. Let's see who's next. Who is UAJ5 2018? I don't know who that is. Ua, Ua. I think it's Huawei J5. I mean, Y5. Who is this? Quien es Y5 2018? No? Nobody? Okay, Jose, uh, do it with Carla. Jose, you start, please. Hello, Mario. <clears throat> what new new today? Did you log in on time? Or were you late this evening? Evening. <clears throat> evening. Evening. Yes. Teacher, what Carla? Carla Cano or you? Oh, oh, sorry. Let me check. I, I, that's true. We have two Carlas. Oh, uh, yeah. Carla Cano. Sorry. Hi, Laura. It's nice to see you this Thursday evening. There's nothing new with me. What about you? No, nothing new with my either. Do you know what we are going to learn today? Yes, I know. We are going to learn to successfully identify, discuss, and talk about reduction of going to. Very good. Nice. Thank you. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, so next, uh, Carla and Marbelli. Carla, you start, please. Okay, teacher. Hello, Mario. What's uh, new today? Did you log in on time or were you late this evening? Evening. 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 Yes. Marbelli? Okay. Hola. Yes, uh, can you continue, please? Or, or who was this? Okay. Hi. Hi, Laura. It's nice to see you this Thursday evening. There's nothing new with me. What about you? 
No, no tenía with me either. Do you know what we are going to learn today? Yes, I know. We are going to learn to successfully identify, discuss, and tell about reduction of going to. Okay, this is successfully identify, discuss. Successfully identify, discuss. Identify. Very good. Okay, let's move on. Let's see who's next. Okay. Read. Okay. Teacher, where is means either? Either. Yo tampoco. Either. Yo tampoco. Either. Either. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thanks. 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 Thank you. Okay, let's see who's next uh, reading. No, A. You are reading this. Okay, go. What are the revolution of this is the other the I to the I to the the Okay, okay, stop, stop right there, stop right there. Very good, thank you. So, as you can see, we have, we have two of the most common Reductions are gotta and wanna. Gotta is the reduction of got to. It's rather strange because it's, its use means have to. In other words, in informal American English, I got to get up early means I have to get up early. This is then part of the rules too. I gotta get up early. Okay, let's see who's next to read. Next is uh, Quadra. Quadra is next to read that, 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 that other paragraph. Go, Quadra. One means one, two. And is used to indicate the desire to something. For example, I want to go home means I want to go home. A synonymous expression is also. I would like to go home. How, however, yes. However, his form is much more is much more formal. Thank you very much. So wanna means want to, and it's used to indicate the desire to do something. For example, I want to go home means I want to go home. A synonymous expression is also I would like to go home. However, this form is much more formal. Any questions here, you guys, about vocabulary or anything? Do you have any question? What is the meaning of for there? For, for there? What line? Mm, the first paragraph, the last line. Okay. For oh, yeah. This is then further, further. We do. Uh, más allá reducido. So further means más allá. Más allá, further, further. Another, another question, please. No more question. Uh, teacher, teacher. Yes. Uh, when, when you use uh, get, um, is um, como regresar, devolver? Uh, no. Get, well, Get has many, many meanings. Eh, con get eh, hay muchos significados. So the, Porque ahí están todos los multimedia resources que están en dev. Mm -hmm. Ahí sí te va a llevar un poco de tiempito. <laughs> What are you talking about? Okay, so get, depending on what you're talking about, is going to mean something else. Dependiendo de lo que se hablo, um, es, el get va a tomar otro, otro significado. 
tiene muchos significados y se usa para muchas cosas. ¿Sí? Ok, ok. Thank you. Ok, moving on. Next. Let's see who's next reading. Oh, what was the last one? Okay, let's begin with the first one, which is Angel. Angel, can you read this, please? Okay. Guana and Gona uh, are two examples for informal spoken American English. Uh, Guana means one, two, and Gona means going to. You will hear these farts, phrases, phrases, phrases in movies, pop music, and other forms uh, of entertainment. Although, come, wait, come although, on. although. Uh, you are less likely uh, to hear them in more formal shows uh, like the news. Very good, thank you. Okay, um, any questions here about vocabulary? Uh, What yes. does it mean, uh, although? Uh, aunque. Aunque. Aunque, yes, although. although. Okay, thank you. Okay, moving on. See who's next reading. Uh, Carlos Alvarado, please. Yes, este, these two expressions are not generally used in writing. Written, written. English, written. Yes, in written English. English would in the spot. English. Spoken. Spoken English. Good in spoken English. Yes. Guagna and Gongna are exactly of reduction. Reduction are short. Commonly used phrase. phrases. 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 Used phrases that are spoken quickly. 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 Yes. This reduction tends to be used for fun for functions, words such as auxiliary verbs. It is important to remember that there are differences, differences. in American differences. English. Differences. That there are differences. Yes. In American English and British and British English pronunciation. British English as also. also. Mm -hmm. British English also has its own exceptions in pronunciation. Thank you very much. Okay, so any questions about vocabulary or anything? Okay, no questions. Let's move on. Let's see who's next reading. Daniel Perdomo, please. Okay, okay. There are different views and whether a student shall use this type of pronunciation. In my opinion, a student who lives in North America. Who live. Who live who live in North America should at least be familiar with this form as they will hear them every day. If a student decide to use this pronunciation, they should remember that it is appropriate appropriate, appropriate only for inform, informal spoken English and should not be used Except for texting, uh, perhaps in written English. Written, in written English. In written. Yes. Okay. okay. Any, any questions here? Vocabulary or anything? Perhaps. 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 Uh, un, eh, except para textear, eh, perhaps could be like. Uh, 
Um, Solo usado para, para texto, en español. Sí, sí, Solo sí. en texto. Solo en texto. Para okay. textear. Solo para textear. Ok. Um, Teacher, what yes. do you mean in the day chart? What line? To use this pronunciation, they should remember if a student decide to use the pronunciation. Oh yeah, if, if a student decide to use the pronunciation, they should remember. They should. Mm -hmm. Should. Yeah. Debe, mm -hmm. Deberían recordar. Deberían. Ellos, ellos deberían recordar. Should. Very good. Okay, let's see who's next reading. Okay, we finished. So that was one. Um, uh, so remember the um, the word is um, wanna and gotta. So wanna is going to. It's a reduction. Okay. Any questions? No questions. Good. So let's move on to the next topic. The next topic is. Oh, Oh, and before that, I'm going to go to the video. Here I have the video about reduction. Pay attention to this, okay? Oh, but before, let me let me do this. Let's see. Let's share computer. Hope oh, my screen sharing. And here we go. So everybody can see here? Yes. Okay, good. Yes. Listen, let, let me know if you can hear the, the, um, the sound, okay? Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn how to sound natural when talking about future plants by reducing... Can you listen to, to the sound of the video? Yes. Okay. Okay, let me, let me start it one more time, okay? Here we go. In this class, you'll learn how to sound natural when talking about future plants by reducing be going to. Let's start by listening to the pronunciation of going to. Reduction of going to. Are you going to have a party? No, I'm going to go out with a friend. Are you going to go to a restaurant? Yes, we're going to go to Nick's Cafe. When spoken, going to is usually going to sound as gonna. Let's analyze the examples one more time. Are you gonna have a party? No, I'm gonna go out with a friend. Are you gonna go to a restaurant? Yes, we're gonna go to Nick's Cafe. As I mentioned in a previous class in which I talked about pronunciation, Pronunciation is one of the most difficult to learn in English. And this is because there are many exceptions to rules that we may mention. The best way to learn pronunciation is by listening carefully and repeating. Today's topic is quite universal. And if you watch your favorite TV program in English, you'll hear gonna instead of going to. So I would like for you to do just that. Watch your favorite TV program in English and pay attention to how going to is pronounced. Good. Uh, so, did you understand about what we were talking about, right? Any questions about the video? No questions. Okay, no question. Very good. So let's go to the second topic for today. Okay, the second second topic for today is this. Okay, the next topic is holidays in the U.S. So holidays in the United States. So we're going to see what this is about. Okay, assume indicator. It will be identify, discuss, and talk about holidays in the U.S. So let's see what's it. The introduction, we already did it, so we're not going to do it again, okay? 
holidays in the US. So let's see who's going to go first. Reading. Teacher, uh, sorry, are, are you share a, a presentation? Uh, I, I don't see. I don't you, see it. You cannot see? Okay, let I me, can't. Okay, I let don't me, see the, the screen. The presentation. Okay, let me, let, me, yes. let me do it one more time. Let me fix it. I don't know what's happening today. Yeah, I was sharing. I was like, what? <laughs> Sorry about that. Let's fix it. Okay, share. Holidays. There we go. Here we go. Now, can you see this? Okay, see. Yes. Uh, very good. Sorry about that. Sorry. Okay, let's move on. Let's see. Uh, so, identify discuss and talk about holidays in the U.S. That's what we're going to be talking about right now. Let's see. The present, uh, introduction. We already did that. Beginning of the class. So, holidays in the U.S. Let's see who's going to read right now. Um, who was the last reading? Can they the Who was it? Angel, I think, no. Daniel. I think Daniel. Okay, so the next reading is Gamaliel. Okay, Gamaliel, you start. Go, Gamaliel. A holiday is a day on which a festival, religious event, or national celebration, celebration is traditionally observed. The day usually has a special significance for individuals, uh, government, or as religious group. The word holiday is uh, derived, de derived, derived from, sorry? Yeah, derived from. Derived. Yes. Derived from holiday. Holidays are observed and celebrate around the world. However, each country and culture, culture has their own special holiday. Often, depending, depending on their history. Very good, good. So as you can see, holiday, the word holiday comes from holiday, which is Dia Santo. So um, any questions about vocabulary here? Uh, yes. Um, no questions. Okay, sure. No questions. Okay, cool. Let's Thanks. see. Next. Okay, who's next? Really? Let's see. That was Kamaliet. Hey, who is Huawei J5 2018? Sorry, I don't know. Who is Huawei J5 2019? Wi-Fi 2018. So who is that? I don't can see. You, you cannot see. Um, ¿Quién tiene como nombre H-U-A-Y-5-2018? Yeah, I don't see that. I think it's the name of your phone. I think it's Huawei oh, yes. 5 2018. No saben quién es. Hello, hello. Okay, so who is this? Ingmar. Well, good morning. Uh, good evening. Good evening. Okay, Ingmar, uh, can you read the next paragraph, please? In this section, we will introduction to you mm, the most important uh, holiday of uh, the English speaking country out <coughs> in Australia. We, we will not consider holiday like Christmas, Easter or New Year. There is even because they are celebrity are 
are around the world. They are not a particular fixture of the present country. Good, thank you very much. Okay, so in this section, we will introduce you to the most important holidays of the English speaking countries, USA, UK, and Australia. We will not consider holidays like Christmas, Easter, or New Year's Eve because they are celebrated around the world and are not a particular feature of the present countries. Any questions here, guys? Vocabulary or anything? No. Okay, moving on. Let's see who's next. Angel, did you read already? Okay. Teacher, oh. uh, yeah? Carla said that uh, I don't see in the video. What? Yes, but, but now I can. Thank you. Oh, okay. Good, good. Thank you. Thank you. So, who's next reading? Uh, teacher, solo. Uh, I un uh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, each American state government uh, determines uh, the official holiday for their state, malls, shopping cen centers, and most other retail business close uh, only on East Easter. Thanksgiving and Christmas, uh, but remain open on all other holidays. The big seven holiday in the USA are New Year's Day, Easter, Memorial Day, Independence Day, Labor Day, Thanksgiving, and Christmas. Thank you very much. Okay, so each American state government determines the official holidays for their states. Malls, shopping centers, and most other retail businesses close only on Easter, Thanksgiving, and Christmas, but remain open on all other holidays. The big seven holidays in the USA are New Year's Day Eve, Easter Memorial, Memorial Day, Independence Day, Labor Day, Thanksgiving, and Christmas. Any questions here, guys? Vocabulary or anything? No. Okay, what is the mean uh -huh. retail? Retail. Retail means that they have their product on site. Uh, retail significa que muestran su producto como en vitrina. Okay. Usted yeah. solo va a traer. Okay? Okay. Okay, let's move on. Let's see who's next. Really. Okay, Carla Cano, can you read this please? Okay. The USA doesn't have national holidays in the sense of days on which all employees receive a day of work and all business is held. Each American state government deter deter determines the official holidays for their state. Most shopping center, and most other retail business, plus and only on Easter, Thanksgiving and Christmas, but remain open all, all other holidays. In this section, you will learn more about the most important holidays in the USA, read about their history and how they are observed and celebrated by the American people. Very good, very good. Uh, this is history, history, and the other one is celebrated, Cele celebrated by the American people. Okay, moving on, let's see who's next. Let's see, next is Carla, who was this? Carla Cano, right? So next is Carla Torrento. Mm. Okay. Verda or uh, Martin Luther King Jr. In general, celebrate 
to dry Monday in January. The United States Federal Holiday marks the birthday of Reverend Dr. Martin Dr. Luther Dr. King, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., which was on January 15th. 119 19, 1929 1929 Keen was an American clergyman Clergy, activist clergyman. clergyman yes activist and prominent leader in the African American civil rights movement the movement Safali Protest, successfully, 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 yes, protested uh, against racial discrimination in federal and state law. King is often present Presented. as presented as yes. a heroic leader in the history of modern American liberals. In nineteen sixty three, he delivered his. I, I have, a, have dream. a dream speech. There, he is painting American values to include the vision of the color blind society. Blind, blind society. Um, establish his reputation, reputation as one of the greatest orators in American history. On April 4, 1968, he has assignment in Tennessee. He was assassinated in Tennessee. He was assassinated in Tennessee. Thank you very much. Okay, um, questions here in this paragraph, guys? Questions? Any questions? Yes, teacher, uh, I have a question. Yeah. What is the meaning colorblind society? That means que, um, in Spanish would be like que la sociedad era ciega porque no veía lo, eh, a, la, a la raza de color. Ok, thanks. Any other question? Ok, let's move on then. Ok, let's see who's next reading. Noé, Noé, can you read this please? Memorial, Memorial Day? Yeah. Yes, Memorial Day. Okay, Memorial Day is, you know, it's a holiday. It was for for formerly known as the Croatian Day. It was observed by people in Charleston, South Carolina. South Carolina? Oh. South Carolina. South Carolina in 1865. 1865 at the Washington uh, School to remember the of the Civil War. The recognition of the foreign was enacted under the name Memorial Day. By an organization of honor veterans to honor honor soldiers of the American Civil War. Our time it was extended after war was to honor all Americans who had yet in the war. Uh, now, known as a Memorial Day, it is a day of uh, remembering the men and women who did in the United States Army Force. Very good. 
questions here, guys? Questions? No, sir. Okay, very good. All right, let's move on. Let's see who's next. Reading. Okay, um, Quadra. Hola. Okay, Quadra, uh, can you read this, please? Yes, Independence Day. Independent, Independence Day is also known as the 4th of July. It is the National Day of the United States and commemorate and commemorate the adoption of the Declaration of Independence on July fourth. July seven, July fourth. Ju, July fourth, seventeen sixty seventy six. Very good. Which declared independence from the Kingdom of Great Bridge during the American Revolution, the legal separation of the 13 colonies from Great Bridge, occurring on July 2, 1776, when the Second Continental Congress voted to approve a, a resolution to independence. After, vo after voting for independence, Congress turned this attention to the Declaration of Independence and a statement, a statement explain, 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 explaining. explaining this decision with Thomas Jefferson as its principal author. Congress debate and revised the Declaration, finally approving its on July 4. Very good. Okay, questions here, guys, about anything? No. Okay, moving on. Let's see who's next, really. Let's begin again. Okay, Angel, can you do this, please? Okay. Uh, Labor Day in general celebrate uh, the first Monday in September. Labor Day is an annual holiday uh, to celebrate two economic and social achievements, uh, achievements, achievements, achievements of workers. Uh, the holiday has uh, it is origins in the labor union uh, movement, which advocate eight hours for work, eight for eight hours for recreation and eight hours for rest. Uh, the first uh, Labor Day in the United States was observed on August uh, 26, uh, 1878 in Boston. It was observed uh, by the Central Labor Union of New York, uh, the nation first in the great major trade Union. It became a federal holiday in 1894 when President Cleveland put reconciliation with the labor movement as the a top political priority. Very good, thank you. And the pronunciation is Labor Day. Labor Day. Okay. Labor Day. Very good. Any questions here? Uh, yes. Ah. Uh, uh, achievements logros uh, achievements logros achievements achievements logros very good you I have a question uh, yes advocate advocate what, what is the what is the pronunciation it? and say meaning oh, advocated which advocated eh, que reclamaba o que pronunciaba Reclamaba ocho horas. I advocated. 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 Thanks. Any other question? Okay. Moving on. Let's see who's next. 
Carlos Ángel Carlos Alvarado, please. Yes. Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Go. Thanksgiving. This federal holiday has traditionally been a time to to hide to give thanks to thanks to God. to to give thanks to God. It had originated for from a mix of European and native traditions. Typically, typical, typically, typically, yes, typically in Europe, 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 Europe. like Europe, in Europe. Okay, go. Europe festivals were held before and after the harvest. The harvest is cycles, 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 cycles to have thanks to God for a good harvest as well as to rejoice, 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 to after much hard work with the rest of the commun community, Native Americans. Native, Native Americans. Native, Native Americans have also cel celebrated. celebrated. Have also celebrated the end of a harvest season. When our Europeans, Europe, Europeans, when, when Europeans, Europeans uh -huh. when Europeans first arrived, arrived, first arrived to the Americas, they, they brought, brought, they brought with them their own harvest festival, tradition from Europe. Europe celebrate celebrating celebrate celebrating celebrating their safe voyage peace and good harvest the event the event, the event that America is commonly called the first Thanksgiving was celebrated to give thanks to God for helping the the pil, pilgrims, pilgrims the pilgrims of Pilmon colony survival their first brutal winter in New England. Today, U.S. tradition compares the holiday with a meal held in 1621. 1621 by the pilgrims. Very good. Thank you. Okay, any questions here, guys? Uh, teacher, uh, what means voyage? Viaje. Un ah, viaje, okay. viaje seguro. Seis voyage. Actually, this oh. word is not English. It's, this is um, French. It's a French word. Ah, okay. Uh, excuse me, it's como bon voyage. Yes, bon voyage, buen viaje. It's that, that is French. It's not English. Uh, thanks. Okay, thanks. thanks. Okay, um, any other question? What do you mean the harvest? Harvest, cosechas. Harvest, cosechas. Any other question? No, 
we're good okay moving on let's see who's next reading Daniel, Daniel, can you read this, please? Columbus Day, Columbus Day. Colum Columbus Day. In general, in general, celebrate the second Monday in October on Columbus Day. The, the anniversary of Christopher Columbus arrived in the Americas which occurred on October uh, 12, 12, 12, 1492. 1492 is celebrate Christopher Columbus 31 October 1451. 10 May 1506. 1506. 1506. Yes, 1506. Was, was an explorer. Colon, colonizer. No se logra distinguir muy bien. No se logra muy distinguir muy bien el texto. Was an explorer. Colonizer. Colonizer and. Navigator. Navigator from from Italy under the suspects Auspices. of the Catholic monarch monarchs of, of Spain monarchs of Spain he completed four voyages across the Atlantic Ocean. These voyages led to the the first fertilizing European contact with America and. Initiated, no lo es. Initiated, In, initiated a period of, of European exploration and colonization. Coloni, colonization. Ahora sí lo logro ver ya. Of foreign lands that have an enormous impact in the historic historical development development of the modern Western world. Columbus himself saw his accomplishment primarily in the light of the spreading of the Christian religion. Columbus Day became a federal holiday in 1937. However, people have to celebrate Columbus but just since since the colonial period. Period, period. Okay, very good. Period. Um, any questions? Teacher, excuse me. Yeah. What's the meaning? Since. 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 That's the pronunciation. That's the since. Since. That's the. Okay, any other question? Okay, we're good. Moving on. Let's see what's next reading. That was Daniel. Oh, Gamaliel. Gamaliel, can you read this, please? Okay. And the win, October 31st. Okay, Halloween, October 31st. This holiday is also called Al Hallows, Eve or Al Saints Eve. It is the night before the Christian holiday all sign on one of first. One, first. Excuse me. One of first. First, first. November. Which, first November, which honors all the saints. No, and who know? It is linked to the medieval Irish festival of Saheim, which marked the end of the harvest. Which Christian news? Christianization. Christianization. The festival in November become a hollow day on November 1st, followed by All Souls Day. Over time, the night of October 30, 31st. 31st 
come to be called called al hello ear hello is you hello is and the festival dedicated to the to the death eventually transformed into this cellular secular 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 holiday now as Halloween. The imaginary of Halloween in the river for many sources, including national custom work of Gothic and oral literature. 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 Literature and classic horror films. It is included in terms of death. Themes of death. Evil, the occult or mythical monster, black and orange, or the holidays traditional color. Thank you very much. Okay, any questions here? No questions. Okay, guys, so we have come to an end. We're going to stop here because we already finished. We have the class done. Stop sharing. Okay, good. Um, let's see, we had only 10 participants today. What happened to the rest? I wonder. Uh, Carla, Cana, uh, Carla Cano, did you see the rest of the video or no? Yes, yes. Okay, uh, thank I you. can see it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, okay. So, any other questions about anything? How you are doing your your tasks and your homeworks? Are you working on your homeworks? No teacher. Thanks. Okay. Very good. Okay. So I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, God willing. We're, well, no, no, no. Not tomorrow. Oh, Monday. See Monday. The last. <laughs> yeah. Today is the last day. So you have a nice weekend. Have a nice weekend. Okay. Thanks. Okay, Thank teacher. You. Thank you. Have a nice night too. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks. Have a nice night. See you Monday. See you Monday.